Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It's me, Mr. Four Cap Scaler. I don't know how many of you actually knew about this or did know about this. I know there's a honeycomb uh, controller, which is fine, uh, but this right here, Velocity One by Turtle Beach, I think it's going to be a big deal, and uh, I want to talk about it a little bit here. Uh, first of all. Uh, the high quality that you're getting here from this uh, Velocity One flight controller will be compatible with a uh, PC and of course it's mainly designed for Xbox Series X and S. So Turtle Beach has worked closely with Microsoft to make sure that they build a truly unique uh, controller velocity one flight controller that will really come in handy for those of you who want to jump into a flight simulator later on um, next month July 27th when it comes out on the Xbox uh, I thought about getting this because this would fit perfectly with my 48 inch OLED TV and the uh, Series X next to it and then this right in front of it uh, with a really nice gaming chair it would really feel to me like uh, I'm a pilot and this will make uh, landings and uh, taking off and flying more accurate and more precise than using a controller. Uh, I was using the Xbox controller to be honest with you because my Thrustmaster it's not compatible for some reason uh, with a uh, flight simulator. And uh, Let's dive right into this. Let's talk about this. Let's kind of go down, scroll down, and uh, give you some rundown as to what this uh, Flight Universal Control System consists of. By the way, all of this is lit up. Uh, everything is lit up here, just so you know. There's a little bit of a more uh, closer look at it also tells you the flight time and everything here as you can see uh, it has a little uh, LCD uh, LED display that shows you exactly what time it is local time your flight time everything uh, so this will really become very immersive right away um, so Turtle Beach obviously has always had a great partnership with the Xbox due to the uh, you know Call of Duty Halo and other games uh, so you know Turtle Beach it's no stranger to the Xbox uh, they partner up with the Xbox in the past and it's good to see that Turtle Beach it's making a controller now for uh, the flight simulator uh, so Velocity One flight universal control system delivers the most comprehensive flight control solution to set up your own cockpit at home and that's exactly what I want to do uh, whether you're an experienced PC player or among the very first to play the flight simulator on Xbox Series X S Velocity One flight equips you with all the controls needed to navigate the skies uh, the Velocity One flight includes everything you need to get off the ground uh, from the uh, your throttles, uh, the mixture of your uh, uh, fuel and other things. Um, again, I'm not a professional pilot, but uh, whether you you flying a you know turbo prop or propeller or a jet liner, uh, uh, this right here it's universal and compatible with all of the airplanes. Basically, what they're trying to say. Uh, that this universal design is compatible with all of the airplanes out there. The only difference will be the jet fighter. The jet fighter, obviously, you can still use this with a jet fighter, but let's be honest, um, you are the reason you purchased uh, this universal controller is for commercial flying private or commercial flying uh, jet fighters that's DCS uh, you have to go with uh, Thrustmaster uh, or others 
okay uh this strictly is for commercial flying and that's what flight simulator really it's about it's not about jet fighters even though they have some of them but flight simulator it's really about uh commercial airplane flying you know so um the included thr uh, throttle quadrant with a dedicated trim wheel uh, which is right over there there's one two three four of them it also has a uh, realistic yoke with integrated rudder to control the uh, e and equip every home pilot with a full suit with a full suite of controls right out of the box so that's cool so basically uh, right in front of that box where the uh, the yoke is and where the LCD screen is uh, right over here you can see the green and the red light uh, these uh, indications here uh, will help you uh, control many different variety of things you'll be able to uh, button map all of this and customize it uh, any which way you want so it's gonna really give you that immersive flying experience especially if it's the airplane that you are most familiar with right uh, Airbus 32 or uh, 373 uh, there's other Boeing's out there you know uh, 777 or 747 so you'll be able to kind of integrate all of that into uh, this universal control uh, and also has the uh, immersive audio and coordinate uh, so that's pretty much uh, that they're trying to tell you you can also integrate a headset audio jack uh, that's another cool feature uh, so uh, right out of the gate uh, you can go ahead and plug in your headphones and or turtle beach headphones and then start flying uh, with this controller so so you can make it even more immersive by connecting that controller with a microphone so you can talk to other players while are you flying uh, I would definitely suggest getting a turtle beach compatible headset with this and plug it in and then start talking while are you flying with other people uh, so this is just one of the many reasons why you want to invest into this um, and again this is the the yoke very realistic yoke it's true to life 180 degree yoke rotation from left to right forward backwards forward backwards left and right um, it's smooth and precise adjustments for any aircraft so basically this will work for majority of the uh, aircrafts out there uh, to the exception of the jet fighters so I don't want to you know include jet fighters because flight simulator it's really not about the jet fighters it's about uh, therapeutic flying and just enjoying the flight and stuff like that <clears throat> it also uh, it's built to last with uh, non-contact hall effect sensor in the yoke shaft you'll have a smooth control over long-term usage so this thing it's made very sturdy meaning that it's uh, balanced correctly so that way and that's the most important thing is the precision of sensitivity and when you are flying that precision of sensitivity on the yoke it's very important the way you make that turn to the left the way you make that make that turn to the right all of that obviously will give you a much better flight experience more precise uh, flight experience uh, so you know that that they're not g giving you some gimmicky plastic uh, low budget uh, type of a toy uh, yoke here you know you know that you're getting a pretty good uh, yoke here that's built uh, sturdy and, and it's uh, calibrated perfectly uh, it also has a module throttle quadrant right here has a dual lever vernier uh, controls along with 10 pro, pro, uh, 10 programmable buttons and integrated with a trim wheel to provide a realistic experience uh, which is pretty cool 
it's uh, for the both light aircrafts and heavy jets. So whether you're flying a Boeing 747 or something smaller, you'll be able to uh, modular uh, throttle quadrant any which way you want. Uh, that's why they call this universal uh, velocity one controller because it's really uh, gives you uh, compatibility with all of the uh, airplanes. It also has a status indicator panel. Uh, receive real-time status alerts and monitor essential cockpit navigation and engine systems and warnings customize the color of the ambient light so you can even customize the color to make it more uh, enjoyable experience swap between three different panels to fine-tune the cockpit to your liking uh, so on top of everything else you also have unlimited customization how you want to customize everything uh, to your preference whether it be the warning signs, which color of the warning signs would you like to have, red or green or blue. Uh, so it's really going to be a unique experience, man, uh, to truly dive into a uh, flight simulator the way it should be. You know, the way I was doing it was just was terrible. I mean, it's laughable. I was using the Xbox One uh, controller. <laughs> I know it, it was laughable. Really, people said, "What the hell? Are we, what the hell are you doing, uh, Mr. Four K? Why are you using the Xbox One controller?" And that's because uh, I couldn't find the flight controller anywhere. Uh, the Honeycomb was all sold out. And well, this right here, guys, which I will talk about at the end of the video, uh, but we'll get back to that. Let's just scroll down and check some more features here. But I'll get to the uh, to, to the point that I was trying to make here as far as the availability of this uh, controller. Uh, it has an integrator rudder controllers, LT, left, uh, LB, RB, RT, right here. Um, has a comprehensive controls, uh, equipped with uh, two POV, two head switches to toggle between multiple different camera views. So that's cool. So you can switch between many different camera views. So everything here, it's right at the tip of your fingers, man. Uh, this is really going to immerse you, especially if you put a 48-inch OLED or uh, even a 55-inch uh, TV right in front of you. And then you connect this right on the t uh, in front of your TV on that table with a nice comfy chair and a good pair of headphones. Man, you're going to be flying... like you've never seen before I know I shouldn't be using that phrase but <sighs> I kind of like it like you've never seen before um, <laughs> and also there's a flight management display the full color display with a dedicated control help to help you navigate through many different things so this right here is really gonna make it more uh, more immersive and um, you know, when you are flying and, and, and when you're looking through with a mouse and, and scrolling down inside the cockpit of that airplane, uh, sometimes you get confused if you're not familiar. But this right here will, will alert you, let you know uh, your altitude, uh, uh, your uh, attitude, your, uh, you know, flight paths and, and, and whether or not uh, you're, uh, you know, having some trouble with your wing or whatever it might be whether there's the icing and stuff like that so this is the velocity one flight controller uh, it's a turn of fifty dollars plus tax you're probably looking at uh, 360 so 360 dollars is it worth it you know that's the question uh, everybody wants to uh, ask right now uh, obviously this is going to be much bigger than the, what it looks like uh, on this screen but I personally think this is worth it uh, to truly get yourself immersed 
in, into a flight uh, simulator. Now, if you're not a hardcore flight sim guy, if you're just some casual whatever, uh, then you're probably not going to care about this. You'll just use a controller and just play it like that. Uh, but if you really want to engage yourself into like doing some uh, commercial flying or, you know, uh, traveling from one location to another or delivering the goods by using different DLCs, programs, you know, which they do have available on the PC, uh, which most likely they will have it on the Xbox as well. Uh, if you're somebody like that who really want to get themselves engaged into that truly immersive flying experience, uh, then this is it. But remember, this is not just for Xbox Series X or Series S. You can also use this with a PC, you know. Uh, so I think that justifies the price tag to me right here, uh, right away. I think you should definitely uh, sign up for pre-order notification because I guarantee you next month, uh, that's why I'm making this video and that's why I saved uh, this last segment uh, for the last. It's the availability. Uh, this will be very difficult to find. Uh, it will be uh, sold out immediately. You know, the scalpers uh, are going to jump on it with their scripted bots and this thing's going to be sold out, then you're going to have to go to eBay or StockX to buy it for, uh, you know, $700 or whatever. Um, you never want to pay more than what the retail price is. So um, I know this thing will be difficult to find. I know this will be a um, struggle to find for a retail price because, you know... Uh, here we go again. You know, we live in day and time where uh, scalpers are just, you know, taking over, man. They're buying everything and then selling it for a triple amount of what the original price is. But I think this is worth it. I'm very excited for this. Uh, let me know what you guys think uh, about Turtle Beach and jumping into this. Uh, I think this will really add to the realism of uh, the flight simulator on the xbox series x and series s and uh it will be a probably highly recommended controller if you want to get yourself uh immersed into that whole flying experience especially what i'm trying to do is uh use my c uh 48 c 10 48 oled as a obviously a, a panel uh, for the game so I can see you know where I'm flying I want to use it as a monitor basically what I'm trying to say is I'm trying to build like a cockpit experience and I want to use this combined with my C1048 to make it look like a cockpit experience uh, get myself a really nice desk table customize it and then get myself a really good gaming chair uh, and then a good pair of headphones, probably a Turtle Beach, and then create the whole uh, immersive flying experience on the Xbox Series X. So there you have it. Let me know what you guys think. Um, leave a comment down below. Let me know. And uh, thank you for watching.